Lada deal, you know. It's a gas, you know. Yeah, man. Gas on the rear. Miami. Straight. No one show Miami. Straight. Oh, Lada deal, remember, we never fear. Okay, boom, viewers, welcome back to the channel. Subscribers, you already know what the thing said. We're blessed. Hope you're having a wonderful day today. But you know the story ain't complete if King Mix Up ain't on the beat. As you heard in the beginning of the video, a lot of people are speculating that Vibes Cartel will be doing a show in Miami in the near future. And as you can see, he liked the post that Nicky Blacks posted with him. I'm saying Vibes Carter, I'll make them know the first time you're performing at the US, I did Miami, the Friday, hosted by me and Papa Kit. Then West Palm Beach, the Saturday, and Philly, the Sunday, courtesy of the general, you know, Fox. And I mean, RIP Fox, it's him, I say, one Gaza, December 31st, 2004. It's him, I say, my people. But speaking about Gaza, you know, say, the people in Miss St. Vanessa Bling. Is this in Gaza? You see me? And I don't think it's, you know, Vibes Cartel. And you know, Gaza, you see it. Obviously, a video of her performing in Israel the other day um, has resurfaced. And honestly, she's always been performing over there, doing her thing. You see me? I say, so it's obviously them love Gaza playing. Because I them, they sang the share sing. And I mean, those are hit song coming out of that camp. You feel what I mean? But here are the questions, I'm in the comments in question, as you can see, guys, a slim performing in, you know, it's crazy. <laughs> and I mean, people, you know, Jamaican people not take things serious, you know. That's why you know, people, you see people are saying underrated comment. And all these stuff. And I mean, boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. But anyway, people, let's proceed to the next. Yo, remember Vibes Cartel? And I don't know, bug of people are for me, friend. But anyway, you see me, you see Skilly Bang. Yes, there? Is there? Fully. December 31st. Freedom no, Street. No, that. Yeah. And yes, me sir. can tell them something. Yes. Yes, sir. On the down grimy. First thing on the knuckle like me. Full, full, of, gun, full of crocodile teeth. Is there? Yeah, is there? December 31st. Freedom Street. Remember that. East side Gaza and a plaza. What the under my nose? I'm out. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, people, it's about officially that time when you know the ticket them countdown. It has to be now. This <laughs> man said, Well, not for cartel. Then we're talking about Sting. We said I'm going promote them thing from a day, yeah, but honestly, it's not looking good. You feel me? <laughs> Boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. And this is what dancehall queen Amari is talking about. You know what I mean? She's talking about Vibes Cartel and Nuffy um, and Sting. You know what I mean? She said, oh, Nuffy, you know, this the program, which I believe so. You know what I mean? He should have just kept his mouth shut and let the businessman deal with them thing. Because I know the situation behind the scenes. You know what I mean? But you know Vibes Cartel, they have road and money are for me. You see, my, I see my people putting out the comment section when they think about that. So I, want, I, I really, really thank Sting for allowing me to, you know, to vaporize therapy. I, I really thank Sting for that. And I'll forever be grateful. Now, I was upset when Nuffy, who was supposed to get a reward this year, decided not to go to Sting not to go for his reward because he want to be there for cartel. Well, then again, that's his business, but I think that one should be loyal in all contexts. But I do find that when I'm loyal, I get fucked. Like when I was loyal to Sika, I didn't see it coming. What the fuck? What, what are you following me for? Your name must be Lion. You fucking fly. Yeah. And um, no, he ain't following my Uzi. It's clean. Yeah, plus I'm taking my probiotics. Don't you see me advertise them? Yeah, and so um, basically therapy was good for me. You know, it just was an unfair game. Unfair game. Everybody loved Queenie. Every, every, people really love Queenie. People don't really love me. You know, but like, like the DJ, the people who introduced us on Sting, they are Queenie fans. You know, a lot of people were Queen of Fans. Leave me the fuck alone. They, a lot of them were Queen... Bomba Clot! A lot of them were Queen of Fans back in the days. 
you know, and um, it so happened that I, I, I'm glad to be invited to sting. Bad news, you ready for the bad news? They're not willing to pay my plane fare. Imagine. It's like it's getting from bad to worse. Now you don't want to, you want me to be at Sting and you don't want to pay my plane tickets. That means you're also not going to pay for my hotel where you expect me to sleep on the fucking streets. I want to cry. I mean, I made Sting. Guys, come on now. Be realistic. When Ninja Man got locked up, Sting was over. I brought Sting back to life. I didn't just come alone. I came with my powers. Come on, guys. But something tells me it's all good, Amari. You looking at my entourage to travel, me to travel. You looking at hotels. The prices are going to go up between Sting being there and Vibes Cartel concert. I may hardly find anywhere. You know, but then I get, I, I got my peeps. You know, there are hotels in Jamaica. They just rate me. But still, you got to pay something. Basically, I'm telling you guys that I want to go, but it's hard. But then, what do you really accomplish without a, some sort of sacrifice? You're talking about ear, nails, clothes, my entourage. I need, I need a lot of people with me on stage because we're going to be performing Amari for president. When I got the news, I was like, no, I'm not going. They got to pay me. But money isn't all, you know. Money isn't all. I would, I would like for... Don't cry, Amari. I would like for them to pay me some respect and put some respect on my fucking name. I've been singing from 10 years old. I know that there'll be people there that you pay thousands and millions of dollars and not willing to pay me nothing after proving myself, but wanting me to be there. I don't, I, I don't know if I can do it. The last time I came up from staying hungry. Did it just wait? Huh? Did it wait? No matter? Yeah, it's okay. So. But I know the minute that Amari says she's going to be on Sting, it's going to change the game between Sting and the Freedom Concert. It's definitely going to change the game. And should I like pack that place, bring in all the money and don't care about a penny? It could be good for me because after performing on Sting and proving myself, I will be getting shows galore. So there's a upside to it. And it's only one thing I'm asking. Let's make a deal. If Amari got to find her own plane fare for myself, my entourage, get my own bodyguard and everything, my own hotel and everything, food and everything beyond my own, give me the interviews. Yeah. Give me the interviews. Give me the interviews like you did for Queenie. Let me go on stage weeks in advance and prepare the way for me performing on Sting. Give me the radio interviews. Give me the TV interviews. Give me the write-ups write -ups in the paper. Give me that. And take your fucking money. And may you and your money burn in hell. But I think I'm going to settle for that and then make the most 
the best of it. Yes, put in the comment section where you think about that. No, I see Richie Stevens made a post. I'm saying what a mighty God we serve. You see what I'm saying? This is why you shouldn't count people out when they're still breathing. You know what I mean? You want to send positive vibrations out there and things and things. You know, he was in, you know, not a good position with there and everybody was doing GoFundMe and praying all of these things. You see what I'm saying? But he reposted saying, just want to let you know that Clive or Cleve is now being fed by a spoon and chewing and swallowing on his own. He even said the words, yes, yeah, last week. To God be the glory. Message from Stitchy Wife at 621, Thursday, October 31st, 2024. You see, man, I my people, man, I got to no more. Man, I got longer. This is no longer because we have more for the trap. So let's keep the thing locked, subscribe with the notification bell, and for you'll be notified whenever I drop the latest. Bless.